Well, here we are at the Half Moon Mill. It's night time as well, which makes me wonder if this is a wise time to encounter a vampire and his wife. Oh, delicious raw meats strewn about. Oh, looks like animal meats though, so that's something. Water's nice and steamy. Top across. Not too chilly. Alright then. Let's try to get inside. No one else. There she is. I feel if I attack him, she will doubtless, doubtless try to slay me. Hmm. If my knowledge about vampires is correct, they'll be asleep during the day and I might be able to attack them without retaliation. Let's see if I can wait around until then. It's quite bright today. What are you doing outside? How are you not dead? Here for work. Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. You kidding me? We supply Falkreath to the south. Until recently, we supplied Helgen. Falkreath trades with the surrounding holds, and without our wood, they would have trouble keeping their prices low. I see. You get many guests? We have guests as often as we can, but there aren't a lot of travelers these days. The war keeps people off the roads. I see. You like it out here? Other people just make things complex. Hmm. Out here, Hearn and I can get everything we need from the occasional traveler. Very interesting. Mm -hmm. It's always a mistake to talk to these people, because then I feel sorry for them. That's twice I swear I heard a dragon nearby. But perhaps not. Alright, Harn. Sorry about this, friend. She knows about it somehow. Take those. Should be plenty. She's still after me. Would appear so. Would appear that it is impossible to lose her right now. Perhaps we'll find something else for her to uh, Enjoy your last breath. encounter. I'm sorry. I'm sure you'll find another boyfriend that you can turn into a vampire. It will help you at the mill. He may not have the uh, same name, but uh, sure he will be kindly and productive for you. Nonetheless. You're outmatched. No, no, I could kill you easily. A couple of shots, but uh, I have no interest. You still here? Ha. Oh, I think she sees me. Yep, oh, she's right on me again. Perhaps we can 
go around in a circle and lose her, surely. Too light on my feet, poor gal like you. Aha! Ha ha! I did lose her. Wonderful. Okay. On then, uh, to the next one. If I can remember who they are and where. Morthal. Wow. Wait, I know you. No, I'm not sure you do. Don't think you've ever seen me before in your life. It's been ages since I've been here. There's no way that you would remember me. It's not like you've heard about me at every street corner or brothel or tavern. Not brothels, of course. Jorgen and I both work hard, all the time. Okay. Murthal is important to both of us. Well, that's nice. Who was I here to kill again? Starts with an L. Oh, dead body. <laughs> Doesn't even have anything good on him. I'm sure I've killed that person, but no clue who they were. None of these names sound familiar. No. Thanks for clearing out that vampire nest. You're welcome. You saved Morthal. Yes, I did. Aren't you so happy to have an adventurer like me around? Clipper and strong. Don't follow me around. You hear? No. Ah. But I miss you all this time. I remember this place. Creepy burnt down. Ugh. Gross. Is the line for my next performance starting already? Oh, I remember. Come on. Don't be shy. Plenty of room for everyone. Where's the music coming Orthal from? Orthal used then. to be a quiet place, but then the world used to make sense. Well, aren't you a dreamer? Aha! Uh -huh. 42 gold! Lying around in this chest. What? What is this? Racial phylogeny and biology. Hmm? This is actually incredibly interesting to me. I would love to read more of this. I'm taking it. There he goes. Going to sleep, or are you just sitting here? Just sitting here. I'm thinking of composing a song about you, Yona. Would you prefer I proclaim your beauty, your strength, your... <laughs> nah, just don't. Leave me out of it. No interest in being immortalized in song, remembered and praised for all eternity? No, I mean it. When I'm known throughout Tamriel, you'll regret this decision. Well, uh, I have bad news for you. You're already known throughout Tamriel. She knows.
If I use my chain lightning spell, which is much stronger than my regular lightning spell, I worry that I'll hit him in the process. I'm not interested in doing that. So I must needs wait till they are well separated. Though I think they're far enough apart now. He's also wide out in the open. The innkeeper will be so angry with me. You leaving? No. It's just moving chairs. That's so weird. Wonder if he never leaves. Benoa. Wonder if he's a cell sword. Wasting away in the tavern waiting for some adventurer to hire him. Yes, well. The guards here in Morthal will remember me now. By the gods, did that really just happen? Huh. Ring of Mina Magica. What are you doing with a Magica ring? Well, that was fun. I probably ought not to stand here and be killed by the guards. Not even sure where he came from, but there he was. Did I make it? Not quite. Nice try. Just water under the bridge now. <laughs> Never recognize me since I have my mask on. Never. Yes, yes. Shoot all you like. You'll never hit me. I'm too sly for you. Would that I could perform these assassinations a bit more stealthily, but I simply have more important things to do than wait around for hours, days, maybe. Get through this creek here. Now, surely I've lost them. Aha! Let us return to the Dark Brotherhood then. I'm back. We need to talk. Well, I'm busy. Look, something is happening here. I'm not sure entirely what that something is, but... Well, we need to find out. Still paranoid. If the Night Mother really did give you an order to talk to a contact, we'd be mad to ignore it. You're absolutely right. And I think we'd both agree. Cicero's brought quite enough madness to this sanctuary. Ah, you're seeing so go, reason. Go to Volenrood. It's a crypt, pretty far to the northeast. Talk to this Armand Motier, and let's see where all this leads, hmm? Finally. Finally you've seen reason. Well, I don't feel like anymore that I've wasted my time by going on these petty little crimes. There he is. The man... The nobody. Please tell me you flayed that horrible bard alive and made a drum from his skin. Well, not quite. I fried Will him. Will there ever come a time when the people of Skyrim no longer need our services? I think not. Yes, everyone's mad to kill everyone else. It's no the way of the world, time. I suppose. You faced a vampire and lived to tell the tale. Well done. It was quite easy. And if you contracted Sanguinari Vampiris, be sure to get that taken care of. Well, she'll end up like our own Babette. She seems to be doing well Unless, enough. Unless, of course, that was your goal all along. Exactly. Here's your payment. Ah, uh, Lorbark is dead. Wonderful. The only good bard is a dead one as far as I'm concerned. All that singing and mirth. Indeed. Your payment, as per the usual. Fantastic. Making so much money. Anything else? Well, aren't we the eager one? Yes, of course. Sorry to disappoint, but there's nothing. Try me again later. I will. I will. Any advice on, uh... Really? You have some disgusting... Go on now. Brother. Habit of standing right behind me. It's really annoying. You may be the listener, 
Or you may just be a lunatic who's started hearing voices. Either way, Astrid is still your mistress, not the Night Mother. Hmm. Speak for yourself. You don't tell me who I obey or listen You've to. Got people to kill, my friend. Best get to it. I don't actually. I have no contracts of the sort. I'm supposed to go speak to a person, not murder them. You know nothing, Nazir. You're a fool. Keep silent. About matters you don't understand. Brother. Nothing, right, huh? Then. Bye. Bye. Every time I go to a place I believe I've cleared out already, lo and behold. Crawling with bandits again. There's nothing in there that I need though. We're incredibly close to that city. I can never remember Windhelm or Whiterun. I have a home there, the Breeze home, but who knows which city it is. Doesn't matter to me. Names of things. They are what they are, regardless of what they're called. Should not be too terribly far, though. Volen Rude. Who knows what waits for us around the outside. Around the outside. Ah, a fox friend is here. Wonderful. Beloved fox friends. Ah, just as mysterious as I anticipated. Vigorous magic potion, hey? I certainly deeply appreciate that. Oh, I didn't want the stamina potion, actually. There, have it back. Huh. I simply assumed the door would be on the outside, but it's fine. Nothing wrong with it being on the inside. Plenty of treasure round about the outside, which is fine with me as well. I'm fine. Everything's fine. Headaches. Bullen rude. Notes. Huh. Skeptical. Obvious now, the old hymns had truth to them. The relief wasn't far from the entrance, just as they said. I've no doubt now that it hides the entrance to Gvenel's tomb. The two keys must be hidden somewhere nearby. Ceremonial replicas of Aachen and Ed Eduj. Favored weapons when Knievel went into battle. I don't dare explore further without hiring bodyguards to accompany me. However, to think the tongue chieftain Gvenel could be entombed behind just a few feet of stone. The ancestor we scarcely believed was real. Twice uh, cursed for planning this foolish scouting trip, I should have hired those cell swords in the first place. Perhaps there's no need. This place is just a tomb, after all, and there are no obvious signs of habitation. It isn't as though the thousand year dead will mind if I have a look around. They will. That's probably what killed you. Because here you are, murdered with a dagger through the eye. And you. Supposedly dead. Now, oh, battle axe. From this angle, I thought it was a pickaxe. All right, you dead heathens. Leave me alone. I'm just here to speak to a mod mortier. Is he also dead? I'm trying to talk to a spirit. I'm sure, the night mother doesn't care either way. Sure, she can converse with whatever 
update a thing maybe in. Or a calcum ingot, wonderful. These. Oh, a death lord. Can't tell if they were thrown down here or if they fell. Oh. Well, that's too easy. It's hard to tell from that distance, but he seemed a bit vampiric himself. Oh, I see. Salt, troll fat I'll take, thanks. Iron shield. He says a sword. And an axe, eh? Well, let's see what these sneaky little sideways places have in store for us. Yep, there are dead things here. Get close together, please. Oh, there's another one up top I just noticed as well. Not further apart. Ah! No. Not allowed to do that to me. Oh, that was quite painful, actually. Hmm. And you know what else? If I have the option, I might as well just get some of these poor buggers that fell down in- Whoa. Fell down into this hole uh, to give me a hand. Which among you would like to uh, do that for me? How about you? You coming? I'm over here. Yes. Then. Aha, I see it. Let me be sure uh, which shout I'm using. Ah, yes, I thought so. going to do anything for me? Didn't raise you from the ancient depths of death to just stand around and do nothing. You hear me? Kill someone. Ha! Oh no. How am I supposed to loot your corpse from up there? Tragic. Well, you shouted at him. I guess that's something. You're still entirely worthless, but... At least 
you tried. To watch out for traps, pressure plates, and the like. Whoa. How indeed. Be quite painful if I felt. Oh. Aha! Got it. Oh. Survived as well. Beautiful. Didn't even hurt. For 12 gold. Risk my life. Uh huh. Oh. Still here? Watch this one. Ancient Nord Helm? Why would I take that? I thought it was something interesting. wasn't as strong as I feared he would be. Uh. Oh, I see. And this one. Well done. Perfect. Good grief. Far better than what I gave you credit for. I'll be sad when you vanish into ashes. Well, we got one half of it. Shortcut. Imagine he vanished by now. It's probably an idea to get this one. Yes, good. We seem to have at least a little gold on them. Well done. Oh. Already carrying your weight. First thing. Yes, don't let him use that magicka on you. Well done. I don't want to say you're better than the other one. Just because the other one had fewer opportunities that were further along. Just the one? Nope, it's both. Cool. Okay, thank you. Bye. Move, please. Wow, I'm just going to stand in my way, eh? Yes, kill him. One more hit. Kill him. Too bad I had to do it for you. Nope, not me. Not me, I said. He's dead. Already. Magicka can't quite replenish fast enough. Can't let him get a shot off, though. Ah, cool. Perfect. Exactly. Oh, no. Ooh. Ebony arrows. Very glad that I did not... have to take one of those to my flesh. Where's the axe, though? 
There's three pressure plates here. What do they even do? Mace etiquette. Oh. Alright then. Oh, is it here? No. Oh, right in front of me. Of course it was. Let's see if some of these arrows that he shot, yes, are ebony. No, that's not what I wanted. Okay, and I suppose that's all of them, it's fine. Let's go open the main door. Fairly certain this one was a magic -y user. Want that X? No. Fine. He seems eager. That's good. This is going to be fun, I can tell. Ah yes, still along, wonderful, here water. I hear shouting. Interesting. Ah, of course it did. You had to run right in front of me. Oh, okay. Okay. Where do you go? Trying to flee from me? Yes. Don't even think about it. I fear I've disintegrated him. I did. Okay. This one is going to be difficult. I wonder if he has any friends. Oh. At least one has risen. Very interesting. Well, if he has friends, I need friends. Just try Ash Spawn, usually a good one. Ah, uh, some exploding flame spiders might help out as well. I'm stuck. It. Ah, 
Aha! Caught you. Sneaking up on me. Ah. Eat my magic up. Can't tell if that's affected him. Could yet be others coming around behind me. I need more Magicka. Extreme, that'll work. Come on, come on. Good. Dead. The others vanish with that. A douche. Oh man. I'll take it. It's not it's not that fancy, but oh. I was worried there. Still hear a shouting wall. I don't see anything though. Aha. Uh -huh. Potions inside. Visibility, light feet. Must have been his pet assassin or something while he was alive. Night falls on Sentinel. Sure. Do I learn anything from that? I do. Amazing. I will take it then. Ah, here's the shouting wall. Speak to me. Oh, interesting. Okay. I feel like I've achieved mastery of the Thume. Alright, so he didn't die. He, uh... Wasted... Wasted shout. It was not powerful enough to be shouted at. Uh, he is powerful enough, though, to help me against his friends. If I can remember... There it is. Yes, flee for your life. Dead thing. Yes. Go punch him to death. You filthy heathen. There's an axe right there. You're gonna pick it up? You did. Ha ha. Well done. Nope. Oh. Okay. Is that weak, eh? Oh. Even more treasures here. Dwemer items, even. Unusual. Minor maze. Interesting. But not what I need to read right now. Stamina. Blech. Who needs it? Oh, extreme healing I'll take. There we are. Oh. Okay. That's it for up here, then. Now we can go talk to Amand Mortier. All right, you. And your friend? Hello there. By the almighty divines, you've come. You've actually come. That's right. This dreadful black sacrament thing. It worked. Okay. Right then. You prefer to listen, is that it? It's kind of my well, title. you must represent the Dark Brotherhood. I certainly wasn't expecting anyone else. So, I'll cut right to the chase. I would like to arrange a contract. Several, actually. 
I dare say the most important work your organization has had in, well, centuries. That's haughty. As I said, I want you to kill several people. You'll find the targets as well as their manners of elimination quite varied. I'm sure someone of your disposition will probably even find it enjoyable. But you should know that these killings are but a means to an end, for they pave the way to the most important target. The real reason I'm speaking with a cutthroat in the bowels of this detestable crypt, for I seek the assassination of the Emperor. That is correct. What I ask is no small thing, of course. But you represent the Dark Brotherhood. This is what you do, no? You must understand. So much has led to this day. So much planning and maneuvering. Now, it's as if the very stars have finally aligned. But I digress. Here, take these. They need to be delivered to your superior. Rexus? The items. It's quite bold yeah. of you to assume that I yeah, have a superior. Letter will explain everything that needs to be done. Mm -hmm. The amulet is quite valuable. You can use it to pay for any and all expenses. Going to have to take this. Thank you. And this. I don't know about the flesh, but I will take the heart. Sure. Is there something else you need? Yeah, absolutely. Ah, oh, extreme magicka? Yes, I will. I'll take that too. Thank you. I have vowed to I have a don't care. Here until my dying breath. Don't Just care. remember that. Perfect. Perfectly fine. Nothing on you. How dare you? Come to me with no pockets to pick. Disgusting. Alright, well, I'll be on my way then. Goodbye. Oh, I suppose he means for me to take these things to Astrid, which is perfectly fine. Oh, hello there. Oh. He dies at my very time of need. I suppose I didn't need him, more or less, but... Well, my first official task from the Night Mother is before me. Uh, this character seems quite wretched, arrogant, stupid, but, um, I don't know, I suppose killing the Emperor would be pretty exciting. So, I shall do it, of course.